this video, we're going to continue working on this activity, 7.1, more dimensioning. In particular, we're going to work on this part. It's a pillow block. It's on page 4. I'm going to start out by opening Inventor. Creating a new part. and a new sketch on the XY plane. Select rectangle, starting at the origin. Enter 2, tab, 2.75, tab, enter. Extrude 1.5. Create a sketch on that face. Turn on construction. Project. Project this face. Turn off construction. Select rectangle. Draw a rectangle approximately there. Dimension. Make this dimension 0.5. Make this dimension 0.5. Finish your sketch. Extrude. Select Cut, select All, creating your sketch on this face, turn on Construction, project this face, turn off Construction, select Rectangle, Draw these two rectangles. Select Dimension. Make this 0.5. Make this 0.5. I'm going to turn on Slice Graphics. I'm going to delete all these yellow lines. I don't need them. You should have two profiles that look like this. Finish your sketch. Select Extrude. Select these two profiles. Select Cut. Select All. Create a new sketch on this face. Select Construction. Project Geometry. Project this face. Turn off Construction. Select Circle Tangent. And select these three lines. Select a center point circle at the center of the, this previous circle. Make that a diameter of 0.5. Select Extrude. Select this profile. Make the dimension 0.5. Start a new sketch on this surface. Project Geometry and project this area and this area. You should have those two profiles. Select Extrude. Select these two profiles. 
select cut all create a new sketch on this surface turn on construction project geometry project this face and project this edge turn on slice graphics Turn off construction, select circle, select the end of this line, make this 0.5, select the end, the other end of the line, you should see a green dot, make this 0.5 also. Select extrude, select your two profiles, select cut and select all. Select filler. Change the radius to 0.25 and select these two edges. Apply. Set the radius to 0.5 select this edge and this edge, apply and cancel. This hole should go all the way through, so I'm going to create another sketch on that surface. Create a new sketch on that surface. Project geometry, that face. Finish your sketch. Extrude, cut, all. Go to Eye Properties. Hover over your part in your Parts browser and select Eye Properties. Select Physical and change the material to Brass Soft Yellow. Save your part, call it 7.1 Pillow Block, create a new drawing, place your base view, set the scale to 2 to 1. Right mouse button OK. Select your ISO view. Change the scale to 1.5 to 1. Make it a bit smaller. And turn on shaded. Reposition your ISO in the corner. Go to Annotate. Select your Centermark tool. Select your center line bisector. Select this, the midpoint of this line. You should get a green dot. And the, mid, the midpoint here, the green dot there. Do the same here. Select the green dots. Select Dimension,
select this dimension, enter space to space capital X, select this dimension, and do the same here, space to space capital X, Go to Eye Properties, select the drawing in your browser, right mouse button, Eye Properties. Copy the file name, Control C, go to the summary and change the title to the same, paste it. Control V, change author to your name. Your finished drawing should look like this. Save your file. Call it 7.1 pillow block. Go to File, Export to PDF. Save it under the same name. and submit your completed PDF drawing to Canvas to complete your assignment.